How's it going everyone, Lord UK here, and we're back with some more potion craft. It is day 23, I'm going to do some exploring on the map uh, to start with. Hopefully I can find the potions that I just couldn't sell last episode. The oil potion, some sort of sticky potion. So let's search around for those. I do also need to create some more Nigredo. Um, if we have a look up here, because we need that to create Albedo. Which will be a task in itself. Almost an episode, I'm imagining. But yeah, there we have it. Create Albedo. So that will be something to come. Uh, for now, we shall just explore the map. See if I can find this oil potion and sticky potion. Let's start with over to the left. I'm just thinking, if I go down here, I can't go left. I don't have any minerals that take me left. I could go right with these frost sapphires. And I could go down. I think what I'll do is I'll go right uh, and I'll use that whirlpool in there and I'll see where it takes me. Okay, it could have been worse. I suppose I can use this earth pyrite? Yes, earth pyrite will take me down. Very nice. Okay, from here we will just head up to that whirlpool there. See where that takes us. Moment of truth. Hopefully it takes us left. Well, yep, yeah, okay. It took us to the same area. That's nice. I was worried we were going to end up back over to the right. Let's hear our dragon pepper sounds. Oh, they're spinning. Very nice. Okay, let's see what's over to the left. Have we got an unknown potion? Oh, we do below that dry zone there. Don't have the minerals to get there, though. Let's head up. Now, where's this whirlpool going to take us? Back down to where we came from. I, I really don't understand these whirlpools. Some of them are good, most of them aren't. Here we are at another whirlpool. Let's, of course, give this one a go, find out where it'll put us. Not the direction I was after, but there's a potion, so we'll head there. As this is super rotated, I'm only going to get a tier 1 from this, so let's see what we found. We found a potion of enlargement. Interesting. Not had anyone ask for that yet. Okay, we'll finish the potion. I'm not going to bother saving it, for obvious reasons. Let's finish it. Uh, let's have a quick look at our book. What is it we've just done? Okay. So need to find gluing. Need to find that. Let's have a look downwards. Down here. I see a line, so let's try and get down there. Navigating this narrow, dry corridor. Whoa, that was close. It is a bit scary. S 
such a great sound. Okay, teleporting over to the right. Aha, and there is a potion we haven't seen yet. Let's get over to that. Because of the rotation of this one, we should be able to get a tier 2 of whatever this is. Nice, there we go, tier 2. What have we found? Potion of Lightning Protection. Only slightly confusing, because lightning's up there, but lightning protection's down here. I assume because down is earth, so it's kind of like grounding, I'd imagine. I suppose that would also mean that where there's fire, further to the left, there will be ice protection. Let's have a look over to the right. Oh, it would be a good idea to finish that potion first. And an entrance has been revealed. Let's head down there and use that whirlpool. That should do the job. Hopefully this will... I, I don't know why I keep saying that. This whirlpool's going to do us over like they always do. Here we go. Oh my god, that's just typical. That's typical. I, I don't understand why you would ever want to use that. Let's see if there's something hiding behind the fog here. Yes, there is. A sideways potion. I don't think we're going to get tier 2 here. I will try and centre it as much as I can. No, it looks like it's just going to stay tier 1. Let's see what we found. Whoa! A potion of slipperiness. We found the oil, finally. Although it's not very efficient at all, I'm going to save this recipe just so it saves me having to come here again with such a, a hodgepodge of ingredients. Alright, next up we shall head down here to the bottom right. We've got three frost sapphires still so we can get here and then teleport over to the right. What's going to get me to that whirlpool? Hold on. Poop shroom. <laughs> okay, we'll use that. Ah, I see a potion over to the right. We will teleport over there and see what it is. We should be able to get tier 2 here. There we have it, tier 2. What have we found? Potion of Poison Protection. Good to have, just in case. Okay, let's finish that potion. Where should we look next? I feel like there's more to look down, so let's go down again. And we are in a tight corridor. Okay, let's work our way round. I don't think I'm going to touch that whirlpool. I spy a potion to the right. Do I go to that or do I keep going down the corridor? I think, how many of these have I got? This is my last frost sapphire. Let's use it. This unfortunately will only be a tier 1, but what have we found? Potion of Acid Protection. 
Okay, another one that I'm sure will be handy later on. We're completing all this chapter though, so that's good. Let's finish this potion and where to go next? Do we go down again? Do we look elsewhere? Oh, look, we can get trading nine. Yes, please. Uh, do you know what? Let's open up shop. Enough exploring. Brought stones. Would have brought more, but I need a potion. Hi there, what kind of potion do you need? Need a potion. Strong one. Cut no need to explain. I know you need an explosive potion, so let's craft that for you now. Looks like I can only make three more of these with this recipe. Uh-oh. Here you go. Show me your goods. Oh, my, my dwarven friend. Come on now. <laughs> Just cloud crystals. Well, uh, thank you. Let's haggle. Thank you very much, and goodbye. Please have more next time. Hello. I came for your help. I made a bet with guys that I could catch this one fish. I would do it, but it's going to hurt. It can tear the rod out of your hands or pull a fisherman right into the water. I won't manage without one of your potions. I think I could help you here. I don't need to ask you what potion you need, because clearly you need a strength potion to hold onto that rod extra tight. Here you go. I remember when I looked at 239 and thought, yes! Hello, Alchemist. I'm always getting into tight situations in the service, getting shot at by robbers or stabbed by bandits. I have a tough job, but I defend the residents of this town, and that's what counts. Anyway, I heard about a potion that makes your skin hard as rock. Do you have anything like that? I could definitely use it. I certainly do, but how did you get by without potions before? Well, we used to have a healer. He often helped me clean and bandage my wounds. Then he disappeared and no one has seen him since. Oh, well, it's a good job I'm here then. Okay, well, I can make you a potion of stone skin. No problem at all. Oh, I can only brew two more of those. Here you go, sir. Here is your potion of stone skin. Let's haggle. 409's not too bad. I need a potion that'll help me run away from monsters faster. My, what vibrant colours you have on. Uh, yes, I can help you. Let's go and brew up a steed in a bottle. Here you go, sir. May this hasten your steps. Hi, alchemist. Interested in stocking up on herbs? Oh, by the way, you can make all kinds of potions, right? I could really use your help. Yes, I can. What kind of potion do you need? You see, there's this place where I used to gather ingredients, but all- Ah, uh, yes, I've heard this chestnut before. I shall make you a potion of wild growth. God, this is the last one I can make with this recipe. Uh-oh. Here you go, herbalist. Take this and show me your goods. Oh, very nice. Exactly what we needed. A top-up of our ingredients. Let's get every single one of these, of course. It's going to be expensive, but I care not. 5,426. Let's haggle. We've knocked it down to 3,256. Very nice. It's a deal. Thank you very much, Herbalist, and goodbye. I need frost protection. The potion's quality is important to me. I'm willing to pay handsomely. Not a problem. I'll need to go to my back room and I shall create that potion for you. So, as I said before, there is frost, and then over to the right we have fire protection. So surely that means there's fire, so over to the left there's frost protection. So that's where we will head. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself, but let's see where this puts us. I mean, it could have been better, but could have been worse. Let's just work from here. And another whirlpool. A ah, good one. Excellent. Okay, so we just need to head down from here. Let's mix this bit out of the way. I noticed this will take me into the dry zone, but I will add some water and that should pull us away. And shall we try this whirlpool? Let's give this whirlpool a go. It has taken us into a dead end, got some experience, but I do see a potion over there. I suppose we'll need to go up. Mm -hmm. 
this should be a tier two. Oh, look at that, tier two already. Wonderful, okay, let's cook this up. This has to be frost protection, yes, excellent. We will, of course, not save this potion. I think that's another goal achieved from chapter six. Yes, it is. Okay, let's take this potion to the customer. Here you are, sir, your potion of frost protection. Let's haggle, please. 445, thank you. I need a potion to slow down my goats. They're always trying to run away. These folks and their goats, they're terrible with animal husbandry. Okay, yes, let's make this. I can only make one more of them now. Here is your potion of slow. Please do it right this time. I need a potion to help me fly to the other side of the river. No problem at all. I can make a potion of levitation for you right now. Here you go. 1092, that sells very nicely. I need to protect my home from potential fires. I'll pay more for a potion made from three types of ingredients, plain and simple. I happen to have a potion of fire protection, but it's certainly not made with three types of ingredients, many more. I need poison so I can poison rats. I can help you with that, sir, no problem. Give me a second. Let's brew this up for the customer. Here you go, sir. A strong potion of poisoning just for you. I feel like this is the cheapest potion I sell. Okay, so it's the end of day 23. Let's get ourselves up to bed and have a good sleep. Good morning everyone, day 24, let's get to the garden, pick our ingredients, not looking too bad this morning, lots of terraria, good, I need that, and let's go and open up shop. Greetings, it's been a while alchemist, well, need to buy or sell anything? Oh, it's always a good day when you're here, show me your goods. Oh, look at this, this is why I love this merchant, blood ruby, not seen that before. I am going to buy everything here. Do I need three more pages? Let's have a quick look at this book. We've got so many, yes. 4,611, let's haggle that down. Knocked it down to 2,767. It's a deal, thank you very much, and I'll see you in a week. I need a potion that will make me brave. I can help you with that, sir. No problem at all. Let's get this potion of rage brewed up. I can only make two of them. Yikes. Okay. Here is your potion. Let's haggle. Certainly sells quite nicely. Thank you. I need to blow up a roadblock. One explosive potion on its way. This is the last one I can make of these. Here you are, sir. Please appreciate this explosive potion. I need a libido potion for my husband. Oh, and don't give me any of your weak potions. I need the best, and I'm willing to pay handsomely. I can create a nice strong libido potion for your husband. It will not be cheap though, miss. Here you are, let's haggle. 1389. Hello, need any mushrooms? Straight from the forest. They even still have the morning dew on them. And a few worms, but I won't make you pay for those. They're complimentary. Hi, my fungi. Why are mushrooms growing out of your hat? Beautiful, eh? These are special mushrooms. Humans can't smell them, but wild beasts fear their scent. When I was young, I would eat these mushrooms before going into the forest, but then I realized I could grow them on my hat. Well, that's handy. Show me your goods. A lovely supply of mushrooms here. Of course, we will take them all. Interesting. Kraken mushroom. Lust mushroom. Yeah, we'll have them all. Not as expensive as I was expecting, but we will haggle anyway. Excellent. Thank you very much. It's a deal and I will see you again another time. I need something to heal a wound. P 
please don't use more than two types of ingredients in the potion, if possible. I do believe my health potion is just two types of ingredients. Perfect, we will brew that. Here you go, sir, exactly what you asked for. I need a potion that will protect me from bandits' knives. A potion of stone skin, no problem at all. Let's brew that. I can only make one more. Here you go, miss, your potion of stone skin. I need poison so I can poison someone. Bear with me just a second while I brew that for you. Here you go, sir. Haggle. I need a potion to imbue an item with the power of lightning. One effect isn't enough for me. I'll pay extra for additional effects. I will have a look on the map for you. Bear with me a sec, please. So if I add lightning, I need another negative effect. And the only one that's nearby that I can see is explosive. Uh, she's just going to have to put up with a potion of lightning as it is. I'm sorry, but one effect will have to do for you. I need a potion to slow down my victims when they try and run away. Begrudgingly, I can help you with that. Let's get a potion of slow mixed. It's my final one. Good lord. Here you are. Let's haggle. 546. Not too bad. Okay, that's the end of day 24. Quite productive. Didn't have to turn any customers down. Okay, let's go up to our bedroom and get a good night's sleep. Good morning everyone, welcome to day 25. Unfortunately, that's all we've got time for this episode. Thank you so much for joining me on this, I really do appreciate it. Please like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll catch you all next time. Cheers! Cheers!